Alrighty, friendos, welcome in today's video. We're doing an episode of You Decide, where we're playing on Zero Sand and Zero Evidence. We go inside, do all the tests necessary to figure out the ghost. I'm gonna tell you how the ghost is. You all get to decide. Time top right, smudge timer. Relation when I smudge the ghost, and it hunts again. Uh, without further ado, let's hop inside. I know I haven't done one of these videos in like 10 years. We're going through a little bit of a phasma burnout, so just trying to find my love for the game again but we're gonna be doing some zero zero you decide today i don't think i'm gonna go on random maps i don't really feel like randomly getting high school so but i'll try to do a little bit of variety try to make it a nice a fun you decide episode here we go dude the audio's been so weird recently sorry i'll shut up but i like heard her for a second upstairs but she's downstairs Okay, well, I do believe I know what the ghost is. So let's go in and hop outside. Take a peek at the journal of four. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now let's go it out and see if we're right. This is indeed the twin, so that time she was the slightly slower twin. I noticed her speed was a little bit slower than normal whenever she came upstairs, so I went decided to loop her. Cause I wasn't sure if maybe she was a Hauntu with my settings. Um, the house starts pretty warm because the breaker's on. So a Hauntu would sound slow. Hauntus are their speed depends on how hot or warm a house is. But um, the different to do differentiate between the two, you look to see if the ghost speeds up with line of sight. Twins will gradually get faster and faster and faster as they're chasing you. A Hauntu will not. It'll stay the same speed depending on, you know, if it's in the cold room or hot room. So yeah, slower's twin that time. I know some people tell me that they have a hard time distinguishing twin speed from normal ghost speed and my what worked for me was just getting super familiar with what normal ghost speed sounds like so anytime i had a normal speeded ghost listening to that um you know finding a song that matches the the normal speed of footsteps so like the song this is the rhythm of the nine also my game is freezing please hold that can kind of help help you tell if it goes to normal speed or not so yeah once you get like a good ear for what normal speed sounds like You'll be able to tell if like yo wait that ghost is slightly slower or that ghost is slightly faster okay we are in do we make we do wait okay okay do we make it i'm not gonna loop them because it's dark so we'll just listen Okay, the hunt is over. It does sound like they came out of the basement. So we'll just chill and wait for them to do that again. But with the lights on this time, I think it's hunting. Okay, so I'm fairly confident I know what the ghost is, but the sound looks like a little weird. I swear like the sound going from like a floor above or below to your floor is a little scuffed. So I want to try that one more time. Um, we'll go here. I swear sometimes I could like write a novel in the time it takes me to wait for these ghosts to hunt again. <laughs> I'm just sitting here twiddling my thumbs. Okay, I think they're hunting. I think I see the lights flickering. I swear they've like increased the rate. I wish ghosts double back. Like they double back for absolutely no reason. Also, I don't know if I mentioned or not, but the salt is disturbed. And I do believe in what the ghost is. Like 
I'll be leaving a ghost and they'll just like double back for absolutely no reason. Like, why are you turning around all of a sudden? You know? <laughs> I mean, I know it makes it more challenging and, and unpredictable, but it's just crazy. Okay, let's go and take a peep at the journal of four. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. And let's pull it out and see if we're right. So this is indeed a gin. So the way the gin works is that when they hunt, they are normal speed. But if they were to see you, so like, for example, when I was in the garage, it was normal speed. Once I stepped out from behind the car and they got line of sight with me, they went from normal speed to slightly faster. That's the way the gin works. The breaker's turned on and they get line of sight with you. They'll like get a big pep in their step to catch up to you and then they'll go back down to normal speed. Which is a, I've had people tell me gin's also kind of difficult to notice. But just pay attention to what their speed is like before they see you and see if when they do see you, it's suddenly they get faster. It's not like the gradual speed up, it's the bam, all of a sudden they're faster. Okay, we are in on Ridgeview. Place from down the shalt. And now we wait. I mentioned this on my streams before, but I would love- Oh. Okay, well now that I'm done having a heart attack. <laughs> um, that is what the salt looks like, by the way. Um, I was gonna say, I, I would love if there was like a super expensive item in the game that was like a button that you could press just to get the ghost to hunt. Because a lot of times I'm sitting here, even on like Nightmare, and my sanity is low enough for the ghost to hunt and they just, like, they aren't. For no, like, no reason whatsoever. But I do believe what the ghost is, so let's go and take through the journal. Four, five, four, three, two, one, okay. And let's go down and see if we're right. Ta da yeah, Very easy, straightforward Wraith. So the way the Wraith works, in case you aren't familiar, is uh, they're the only ghosts that will walk over salt, but not disturb it. So other ghosts will walk over the salt and like, leave up, you know, they'll stir up the salt. I don't know if I have any other way to put it. Uh, Wraith's the only ghost that won't do that. So pretty easy peasy stuff. You could literally figure out Wraith first hunt if you remember to bring salt in, which is why I always bring salt in first hunt. Um, let's go play in Point Hope. I legitimately keep forgetting that this is a map in the game. I just <laughs> keep forgetting. It's just not very fun on zero zero because We've arrived. Check the equipment. It really kind of depends on where the ghost is. Um, if they're like kind of near the top, is it very difficult to aggro them to an area where I can actually get a visual? Really aggro them at all because they just can't hear me. So, fingers crossed it's in a good spot. My favorite spot to loop them on this map is probably the kitchen. Although, I on it. Okay, well, I think they're actually in the kitchen, so. Um. Jesus. <laughs> I really haven't looped ghosts in many other spots, so. I haven't had this hiding spot in a very long time. Did they, like, get rid of it or something? Like, I feel like I should have this. What was that noise? I'm like half tempted to just, uh, start a timer. For how long I've been sitting here waiting for them to hunt, but screw it, I'll do it. <laughs> okay, so that time is just how long I've been sitting here waiting for them to hunt. Oh, okay, they're hunting, but downstairs? Okay, well, that was weird. So she hunted downstairs. Um, stir up the salt. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try to go get a crucifix and some firelight. Okay, we're back in. I don't, I doubt like this is the ghost room right here. She might be more out there, but let's start here. 
Let's see how it goes. Oh, the breaker is right here. That's huge. Okay. I think she just touched that door. Breaker door. Okay. Ooh, a light just got, I think, turned off. Oh. Um. I think she's turned. I can, like, never tell on this map. She turned off. Okay, so there's this smoke jammer. Oh. Okay. Um. <laughs> Alright. Okay, she did just turn this light on. Oh. Okay. I was gonna check if there are any orbs for you all. I know I normally don't share in these videos, but she keeps doing stuff while I'm trying to check for orbs, so... <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think she did just turn off the breaker. It got really dark. But thankfully, the breaker is right here. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Hmm. The hunt is over. Oh, okay. Okay. Ghosty again. So I don't really have a flashlight to keep the aggro. I left that downstairs, so. Hello? is over. I'm trying to think if there's any other tests that we can do. Uh, we've just about done them all. I think the only thing I can do is maybe do like one more smudge timer. So that last one was 209. We'll try that. Smudge timer going. is over okay well this smoke shimmer it was well over well not well over but not over 90 seconds the ghost hasn't haunted yet so i think we'll go ahead and take a peek at the journal four five four three two one okay let's go down and see if we're right Of course you were, Yuri. <laughs> so I ended up going with Goryo. Let me see really quick. Did you do... Uh, abilities used once. So she did do the ability. I didn't hear it. Maybe you all heard it. Um, I mean, there's like a couple ghost events where she shut the door, but... 
Yeah, so I never saw the ability. In case you don't are familiar with Yuri's the Yuri ability is they will um fully shut a door. So like outside of a ghost event, outside of a hunt, a door will just shut. Um usually you, you hear like a double door touch at the same time and then like a delayed door shutting sound. And if you were to take the EMF reader over to the door, you'd have two EMF readings on it. I didn't hear that. Apparently it happened. So uh, yeah, I went with Gorio because it never seemed like she changed her room. Like she kind of wandered to the the foyer. And went up to the kitchen a little bit, but I didn't it seem like she was always kind of in the main living room. So. Unfortunate. All right, let's see. Let's go to which I grabbed in. Okay, we are in. Oh, perfect. Go see. Go see. Go see. Go see. Go see. Ghost, 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 ghost. Ghosty. Now y'all may be thinking a certain ghost because of what, what this ghost just did, but Grafton is particularly tricky for aggroing ghosts, so I'm going to uh, try that again. You absolutely would just be the demon child as well. It's, I love that. Love that for us. Day 94 of sitting in the kitchen waiting for the ghost to hunt. She still hasn't. Oh. I was just coming out here to like open the front door so I can hear when it shuts. Oh, and then. <laughs> I was just out here playing the piano. Uh. Here we go. Ghosty. Ghost, 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 ghost. Ghost, 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 ghost. And the hunt is over. Okay, I just want to try one more thing. I'm pretty sure what the ghost he is, but I've had the same ghost fool me many times on this particular map. So I'm gonna try one more thing and then we will go. I think. I thought I heard a light turn on, but I don't see anything, so. Okay. Here we go. Ghosty? Ghost, 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 ghost. Ghost, ghost. Ghost, ghost. I don't know if she doubled back there at the end, but that was weird. <laughs> okay. Well, I do. No, no, not taking that phone call. Not taking the phone call. It's going to be the journal of four. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Oh my God, she's still ringing the phone in there. <laughs> Let's go load out and see if we're right. Okay, it was indeed a yokai. So, a yokai works is that they have a really hard time hearing your voice or detecting your equipment. So in that case, you know, you're we yelling at the ghost, had our flashlight on and she just wasn't hearing us. They have to be like basically right next to you to detect your equipment or hear your voice. So one of the best ways to test for yokai is just sit behind a door with your flashlight on, yelling at them and seeing if they come towards you. I was just making sure that she wasn't like a Raiju because Raijus will affect your equipment from further away, making it look like it's a yokai when actually they're just a little bit outside of the detection range because they're affecting your equipment. They're disturbing your equipment farther away. So that's just one thing I was checking. I've also had like non-yokais do that same thing on this map. Um, I don't know why it's like, they're. F I think it's cause I'm yokai testing right as they're leaving the detection range. So they're just slightly disturbing my walkie talkie and flickering my flashlight, but they've just left the detection range. Oh, that's very difficult to explain, but it was a yokai, huzzah. <laughs> I do believe those are all the games I have for y'all today. Hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop the video a like. If you're new here, drop the channel a sub. Good luck ghost hunting, and I will see you in the next one.